Hi, I'm Riley with Swim, and today I'm going to show you how to download Qt.io, which is a free cross-platform app maker for both mobile and desktop. So to start off, we're going to go to Qt.io. It's literally the letters Qt because they're just super clever. It's a cute way to write cutie. To get to the free downloads, we're going to scroll all the way down. And then we're going to go ahead and click on Qt for application development. It'll take us to another page and it says open source. Open source generally means free, so you know you're in the right spot. Go ahead and click get your free open source packet. And then click download now. And as you can see, it'll start to run. And then go ahead and open it once it finishes downloading. You will have to create a login for it. I've already created one. They make it super, super simple and easy. Just go ahead and do that. And then click next once you've created your account. Just so you know, anytime there's a loading screen like this, it does take a really long time. Um, I've actually doubled the speed for this to load, so as you can imagine, it, it will take a long time and there are two of these, so you will need to be connected to good Wi-Fi and you will have to be a little bit patient with it. It's particularly picky about the directories, just go ahead and click next. Uh, that error message is telling me that I already have it downloaded, so I'm just going to click yes. You only need that bottom one. Go ahead and click next. And then, of course, we've all read the license agreements, right? We always have. Go ahead and click next on that one once you clicked yes. Just click next and go ahead and click install. Uh, I haven't actually sped up this part whatsoever, so as you can see, it is moving incredibly slow. This last piece can take anywhere from 10 to 30 minutes, so just be patient with it. Give it some time, but other than that, that's it. You're all done.